Yeah. Gone like the wind. She just caught again. Here we go again. And I'm gone like the wind. Gone like the wind. She just caught again. Here we go again. And I'm gone like the wind. Gone like the wind. I was born to win. I was born to spin. Lying in the den. I've been trying to draw that plan up. Finally got them numbers ran up. Oh, she just told me she a dancer. Probably cause she know I'm ballin', baby. Getting money out of Marvel, baby. Don't get mad if I don't call you, baby. Yeah, yeah. Hi, everybody. Thank you for watching. <laughs> My name is Mercedes. Um, and this is Zach right here. So oh, hey. <laughs> today, what we're gonna be doing is the Not My Arms. Obviously, they're <laughs> Not My Arms. Um, but what he's gonna be doing is he's gonna be doing my makeup. So I laid out a few things out here. I don't think he knows what any of it is, but um, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get right into it and just see how this turns out. So I'm gonna begin with brushing my hair. Um, brushing your hair is really good for it. It makes it grow. <laughs> it makes it grow and it's okay if you get a little bit of knots here and there when I'm brushing your hair. Just work through it and you'll be fine. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that down. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna begin with, let's see what I'm gonna begin with. Um, looks like I'm gonna begin with olive oil. <laughs> so we're gonna begin with bronzing up the face. So putting a little bit of bronzer before the foundation. <laughs> Never really hurt anybody. This is a really good technique. Um, if you really want that inner glow, get a little bit on your teeth, that's That's fine too. <laughs> They're like freckles for your teeth. Um, Alright, so next what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna um, prime our face. Yeah, no, we're gonna get the primer. We're gonna get the primer, we're gonna put a little bit on our hands and we're gonna just make sure that we're really primed that way our makeup lasts all day. All right, that's a little bit too much. It's all right. <laughs> all right, so you're just gonna go ahead and rub this all over your face. Make sure you get it in your eyes and your nose. <laughs> get, get those creases. So we're gonna go ahead and begin with doing our eyebrows. So I use Anastasia Beverly Hills in medium. So I'm gonna take my brush, my eyebrow brush, and I'm gonna make sure that I get a lot of eyebrow product. Because the darker the brow, the better. So I'm gonna go ahead and begin outlining my eyebrow. Fill all the way up to your temple because it just fucking looks good. You know what they say, the higher the arch, the closer you are to God. So. All right, and then you're gonna go ahead and just brush them out, make sure that all the hairs are slayed and laid. If you cut yourself a little bit, it's fine. The blood, the blood won't do much to your hair. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do the eyeshadow now. I'm thinking about going with a really like berry, you know, Thanksgiving type of vibe. All right, so this right here, um, it doesn't really give me a name, um, but we're gonna go ahead and put that in our crease. This is gonna be our transition color. And then just make sure to blend because you can never go wrong with blending too much. You want a really seamless transition between all your colors. <laughs> Blend, blend, blend. I said fucking blend! <laughs> All right, there we go. So now for our lid color, I'm just gonna go into my Tartlet palette in Toasted. And we're gonna go ahead and, what color am I feeling like? I'm gonna do this one right here. It's called Sunrise. Now we're just gonna go ahead and put that all over the lid. All right. Now we're gonna go ahead and dip back into that same color. <laughs> all right, so do the same now to the other eye. All righty, perfect. 
perfect. There we go. All right, so next up is the, we're gonna wing our eyeliner. We're gonna make this shit sharp because I'm trying to cut a bitch. And just make that edge sharp as shit. <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and move down to the other eye, do the same thing. We wanna make our eyeliner look like sisters, not like cousins. <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and start off with the foundation. Um, so I use MAC NC35, let's see, let's see the bottom of it, NC35. So we're just going to go ahead and put a little bit on the brush. Right, just a little bit off of the brush here. Alright, yeah, now it looks good, alright. So now we're going to go ahead and put the foundation. And if you fucked up on your eyeliner, this is the time to fix it. <laughs> this foundation covers everything. So we're gonna go ahead and conceal. So I use the Naked Concealer. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and make a triangle under our eyes. Eye. Um, we're gonna do a line on our forehead. Now the other eye, another triangle. <laughs> Um, my chin and last tip of the nose. There you go. And just because I lost my beauty blender, I have no idea where it's at. We're substituting with the brush right now and blend that out. And the concealer really helps with brightening up those under eyes if you have like dark circles, things like that because you don't sleep because of your kids. So we're just going to make sure that we blend that out really, really nicely. I'm trying to blend out that foundation too if you didn't do it the first time. Right now is definitely the time to do it when you're doing your concealer. Alright. Perfect. For one. <clears throat> cool. Alright, so next we're going to go ahead and bronze the face. I don't really like to contour um, because I'm dark. So I want it to look like a skid mark on my cheek. So we're just gonna go ahead and bronze because you know all the bitch likes to look bronzy and tan. I like to I like to look like God kissed me. The sun kissed me. Alrighty, so since I have a big forehead and my forehead is bigger than your future. I like to bronze my forehead too. Makes it look a little bit smaller. There we go. All right, get into that hairline. All right, there we go. All right, so next, we're gonna go ahead and set our face. So I'm using the Ciate London setting powder. So, we're gonna go ahead and set our face. Oh my eye. Oh, baby, you got it in my eye. Like literally. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't even think right now because. Let me see. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and highlight now. We're gonna highlight the cheekbones, the bridge of our nose. Low bitch. Do the same thing on the other side. And then on the bridge of our nose. All right, there we go. So what I like to do is I like to take the same highlighter and then I like to get a smaller brush. If you have some wine, just chug half of it. So we're gonna go ahead and get a smaller brush with the same highlighter and we're gonna highlight under the eyebrows. Under the eyebrows, there we go. And then same thing on the other eyebrow. And then the inner corners of our eyes. All 
All right, and there you go. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the mascara. I like to put on a little bit of mascara before I put on my um, my fake eyelashes just because it helps it blend together a little bit better. So. And what I like to do, um, I like to take a little bit of mascara, whatever's usually left over from whenever I do my eyelashes, and then I like to put a little bit on my eyebrows just to set them in place, just to keep the hairs from moving all over the place. So we're gonna put a little bit on our eyebrows. So just put a little bit on there, there you go. Okay, so normally I like to use tweezers, but just for today's video, we are gonna use my hands instead. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just put a little bit of glue on it. This black one is really good. It usually dries really, really fast, so it slows down or it um, shortens up the dry time process. So that way I can just usually put my eyelashes on. If you get a little bit of glue on the eyelashes, it's completely fine. It's normal. It happens all the time. All right. There you go. All right. There we go. All right, so now that you have both eyelashes on, the last thing for us to do is going to be to do the lips and set the face. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my lipstick for today. I'm gonna be using the Milani. That's gonna be the lip color that I decided to do today. I'm not gonna put on any um, lip liner today. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes, those are my lips. All right, perfect. So normally what I do is I will stick my finger in my mouth just to make sure that it doesn't get in my teeth, so. And <laughs> that takes all the excess lip gloss off. Okay, and then uh, last but not least is gonna be to set our face. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the setting spray, shake it up just a little bit. All righty. And that completes today's look. I hope you guys enjoy. Please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Turn on those post notifications. That way you guys get notified every time we post a new video. Um, and if you guys have any suggestions, make sure to leave it down in the comment box below. Um, and that's it. Until next time. Bye! <laughs>